Tonight, we're learning more about a Hattiesburg shooting that killed a father and left his two year old son in the hospital late last night. We brought it to you as breaking news on our 10 o'clock broadcast last night. 29 year old Terry Barnes was shot through a window. His family says he was holding his child who was also hit by the gunfire. Now loved ones left behind are pleading for answers. As you can see right here is where the bullet grazed him on this side. Tonight, two-year-old Tristan Barnes is still in a Jackson hospital bed, surrounded by family like his grandmother, Sharmika Allen. We are holding on right now. We're doing the best we can by, you know, trying to be here by his side. It's been a little more than 24 hours since someone shot into the family's home on Whitney Street in Hattiesburg. This perpetrator actually walked up to my daughter's window and shot inside the window while his father was holding him. Tristan's father, 29 year old Terry Barnes, was killed in front of his children, now left to grow up without him. He loved his kids and he was a provider for his kids. Young folks or old folks, I don't know who it might be or what age they might be, but just people in general need to stop the act of violence, especially against people, homes and kids. Justice needs to be served. Hattiesburg police continue to investigate. So far, no suspect information has been released. Allen knows someone out there can help. People need to talk. It ain't no such thing as snitches get stitches. You rather to send people bearing their children. Tristan is sedated while doctors monitor him for brain bleeding. The two year old has been in and out of the hospital since birth with Hirschsprung disease. His family says Tristan only knows how to fight. In the meantime, they remain hopeful. Police will find whoever fired the shots that changed their lives forever. Keep us in your prayers. And like I said, anyone that's out there that knows anything, please contact the Hattiesburg Police Department. Now, in addition to Hattiesburg Police, you can also call Metro Crime Stoppers. That number 601-582-STOP. The family started GoFundMe pages for funeral expenses and medical bills. We'll have a link after this broadcast online at WDAM.com. Loved ones plan to hold a vigil for Terry Barnes tomorrow.